What's crack a -like and challengers? I'm your host James Moreland. Today is Friday. I'm actually filming this video on Friday and uploading it on Friday, so that's pretty cool. And whoever comments in the first 30 minutes to an hour, I will actually be replying to you. So make sure you guys drop some comments down below. Also during the day, I'll be replying to some randomly. So yeah, we got a box. And you guys know what comes in this box. Some plants from H2O Plants. So he hooked me up with some more plants. Make sure you guys check it out down below. You guys get 10% off your next order. So use the link down below. So when I said I had some tanks that needed plants, I just said really to surprise me. So I honestly don't really know what's in here. There are quite a few plants. Guys, look how green these things are. Like this is a really good plant shipment. And now we can talk about substrate. So as you guys can see, this tank only has like pebbles and rocks and stuff. It doesn't have sand or it doesn't have dirt. So there are not that many nutrients in this tank. And how we're going to fight against that is putting A, root tabs, and also B, liquid fertilizer in the tank. And this is a common substrate that a lot of people use. A lot of aquariums have it. So we're going to have to fight against it. But we have five plants that we're going to put in here. Actually, I have the names right here with these fancy little cards. Jungle Val, Four Leaf Clover, Crypto Lotea, Broad and Nero Leaf Sag, Anubis, um, Asfieldy, and yeah. Actually guys, one thing that I want to do for my fish room is learn all the Latin names of the fish that I have personally. I think that'll be pretty awesome and pretty hard. I actually tried learning how to say guppy. I mean, I'm going to butcher it right now. I need to look it up. Posilia reticulata. Hopefully some of you fish experts didn't uh, roast me right then. I mean, I'm, I want to learn Latin, at least for my fish, just so I have more, uh, more knowledge of them. I think that'll just be pretty dope. So in my own tanks at my house, I only have one of these plants, which is the four-leaf clover. I don't have any of these, so the, all of these are going to be new to me. Um, and I love getting new plants and just expanding my uh, horizon of plant keeping. And we have an angelfish, and angelfish love planted tanks. I probably should have waited, but I saw him at the store, and I was like, I need this one. And by the way, I think I mentioned this in the last video. He's doing pretty well. Um, I haven't really noticed any more damage. So I'm going to add all these new plants in, and I'll be back... Uh, or I'll just do a time lapse of me adding them in. Yo, these are dope. Remember back when, dreaming about the light. We didn't realize how to get there, there'd be sacrifice. We didn't take into account. You guys may be wondering why I'm not bleach dipping these uh, plants. And that's because we already have duckweed in here. And in all my other takes, I haven't noticed that any of these plants come with any pests or anything. I mean, if you wanted to go that extra step, you could. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna keep going. Craziness of life. Remember setting up those speakers, calibrating lights. Yo, this Hoping plant that is really awesome. Come support us for I've never night. seen this before. It made it 20 it looks, in a crowd. We thought we owned the world. It looks really nice. I might like need I was to get some of my old take. girl. Heard she came through for a bit. I was like, word. July, I moved to San Fran. Now we's taking over. Mickey and Jason moved to Aspen. Their life started over. But when we talk these days, don't feel a day has passed. Still the same sand within that hourglass. Austin, wish I saw you more. I'm happy that you're doing good. Over do for a team reunion we probably should no it ain't what we had all planned but it's working out turns out change is all you can be certain about don't change don't change don't change even though life ain't the same say, say, don't change don't change don't change life don't make it happen anyway say, don't change don't change don't change even though life ain't the same they say don't change don't change don't this plant's pretty difficult. I don't know. It has, it floats. At least it tends to float. We never change. But I think what they mean isn't what they say. I'll always be the same kid speaking from his heart. The one who steps into the lab all to push the art. Who steps into his mind just to pick it all apart. The extroverted introvert who's All right, so I already propagated two plants. I propagated some of this four leaf clover and put it over in the corner. So hopefully we'll get some more. And then I don't know the name of the plant, but I snipped it off. It already had some roots growing. And there's actually another one. So the angelfish really likes this. There is some debris in the tank, but that's going to be sucked up by the filter and maybe another water change. But I'll show you guys the cinematics of it right now. I took was never gold. It was frozen. I was slip sliding steady through emotions. Gave my heart to passion, even after passion broke it. That's real. Don't change, don't change, don't change. Even though life ain't the same. Say, say, don't change, don't change, don't change. Life gon' make it happen anyway. Say, don't change, don't change, don't change. Even though life ain't the same. Say, say, don't change, don't change, don't change. But no matter what you do, gonna happen anyway. 
Alright guys, so that's it for the video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. It was a lot of fun. As you guys can see, the nice plants in this tank. It's really awesome. Make sure you guys drop some comments down below. Also suggestions for 90 gallon stocking and also a 45. So guys, catch y'all on the flippity flop. Ski y'all later. Bye. Don't change, don't change. Life don't make it happen anyway.